So welcome ladies and gentlemen to the next episode of Master League. We're up to match day 11 here in the Premier League. You can see we're currently third. I mean, it's pretty interesting, quite realistic really when you look at the table. Arsenal leading, City second, United third. I mean, West Ham up there, Chelsea sixth, Liverpool seven. But it's going pretty good. I'm enjoying it. You know, we're not winning every game. Uh, I think me playing obviously level support off has made it more of a challenge. Me playing with uh, Team Spirit being pretty bad recently has also made it more of a challenge. We've got to try and work our way of getting that back up. But today, we are playing West Bromwich Albion in this episode. Hopefully, it should be a very entertaining game. You can see here, Rooney is uh, knackered. Schweinsteiger's not up for this game either. Schneidling, on the other hand, is up for it though. So, we're going to have to make some more changes. That's the way things are working out at the moment. Griezmann, I mean Griezmann's tired. The reason being is they've all just come back from international duty. I mean Griezmann hasn't played in, in a while. I've had to rest him recently. That's a shame. I can't play him again. I can't play him like that. Risk of him getting injured. And I, I just can't be having that. So Lingard is possibly going to have to come into the team today. Even Fellaini's not up for it. Rojo is going to have to replace Godin. Uh, David De Gea is uh, not looking great either. Let's see, Valdez, yeah, he's up for this game. Martial's good. Really, Markovic being the only player now that I have to replace with someone. James Wilson's up for it. So what I may do here, put Wilson on, and I'll put Martial. I mean, we've gone down to a 73 again. It's pretty terrible, but that's all I can do at the moment. I can't do much else. Martial on the right, Lingard on the left. If I change those two, nah, it's not going to do much. That's fine. Luke Shaw, Rojo, Jones, Damian. I think we're going to have to go for that. Too many tired players today. We'll stick the likes of Griezmann on the bench. Maybe put him on late. We'll have to wait and see. But, yeah, unfortunately, everyone's knackered from international duty. So, here we go. West Bromwich Albion in today's episode. Let's get it underway. So we're under the floodlights for today's main event. West Bromwich Albion taking on Manchester United. United have not won a game in over three matches now. Defeats to Liverpool, then lay on. And finally getting a point against Arsenal in the last game means they really, really have to get back to winning ways in today's matchup. West Bromwich Albion are going to get us underway. Once again, a couple of changes to the United side. What with international fixtures playing quite a pivotal part in a lot of the players fitness all across the board James Wilson getting a start today Martial starting on the win Lingard gets a start as well as West Bromwich Albion work it nicely and Abri had a chance to swing that one in a little took a bit of a deflection there Harnick's done really well oh, what a save from Valdez after just three and a half minutes what a let off for Manchester United now they look to spring that quick counter it's going to be Martial feeding up line to find Schneiderlin. How's the delivery? It's not bad at all. Lindgaard header has actually gone the other way. To find Luke Shaw. Good feet by him. Back to find Jesse Lingard. Matter. Feeding it outside to find Schneiderlin. It's going to be Damian strike. It's a great header by Shaw. Wilson crowded out by numerous West Bromwich Albion players. Fletcher. It's a ch challenge by United. Jesse Lingard finding James Wilson. Oh, it's tipped away by the keeper who made a right meal of it. It's going to be Juan Mata to swing this one in. Looking for Martial. Lingard couldn't get there. He's come back out towards Shaw. Jesse Lingard finding Damian. Martial, not a bad idea. Damian pushing up. You can see Luigi's today has told United fullbacks to get moving. Push up. We need numbers forward. We need goals. We've got to get back in contention with this Premier League title. And they have dropped numerous points in the last games. Only one point from possible six in the league. That's a good challenge. James Wilson finds Damian. How's the delivery? Oh, it's deflected. Anthony Martial. Luke Shaw let that run past him, which actually wasn't a bad idea. Tipped away by Foster. Now we're coming up to half an hour played. West Bromwich Albion really haven't shown up at the moment. 
just sitting back, almost inviting pressure on themselves. United continue to dictate the game, looking for those intricate one-twos, and Mata has decided to just plough his way forward. It's another great save, and Herrera's follow-up isn't in. Well, Mata's having a field day because no one's closing him down, just decides to take this through. Keep going, pass Fletcher, another good save by Foster, and then Herrera couldn't get this goalwards or on frame. It's not a great clearance there by Foster. United win it back again. I feel at some point West Brom and Jalbin have got to do something. Now here's Ander Herrera. Brilliant run by Herrera and there it is. Finally United break the deadlock and it has been coming. West Brom and Jalbin are going to get punished sooner or later. You cannot defend this bad and expect to get away with it. He picks up the ball here. He skips past the initial challenge. And then still, it's a wonderful finish. I mean, from 18 yards to bend that in off the woodwork. Well, United lead 1-0. 32 minutes on the clock. Conditions becoming a little bit more wetter now. I think with United this season as well, it's been a selection of goal scorers for them. It hasn't really been coming from one source. Different goal scorers all the time. Herrera picks one up. Mata will pick one up. Even Phil Jones picking up one in the uh, Champions League recently. Rooney has had a few, but he's been rested lately. And here's Mata. United continue to play some lovely football. It's beautifully done. It's under Herrera. It's come off the post. And United should be leading by two. West Brom and Jalbian getting carved wide open. Almost uh, like Christmas Day at the moment. Whipping out a turkey, carving him open. So 45 minutes left on the clock. No changes for United, not surprisingly. I think Luigi today would love to rest the rest of his players for the remainder of the match, unless they really do need to come on. They still have Tottenham to play in just a couple of days' time, and that's going to be a big one for them. Martial couldn't get there ahead of McLean. Harnick, West Bromwich Albion, they've got to start pushing numbers forward. They're not really creating anything. They didn't do anything in the first half. Well, here's a chance to swing this one in, but Darmian does really well. And Schneiderlin looking for Lingard. He's also done well himself there. Schneiderlin's brilliant play by him. Martial through the defender's legs. Keeps the ball alive! Oh, brilliant move! James Wilson still trying to get there. Foster finally gets claim of the ball. Lovely work though down the wing by Martial. And Wilson showing that he is alert. He is lively. And here is uh, Harnick who's done well. Fletcher. Harnick once again. United will get it out. Matt is slipping all over the place. Chance here for West Bromwich Albion. Morrison, great interplay. Oh, and they are level. Unbelievable. United really have got to do better. West Bromwich Albion's first real chance of the game. And they're level. Well, Luigi definitely won't panic because United have been in control in this game, but... The worrying thing is all that chances, all that bit of possession. Now they're 1-1. They're going to have to start again. Here's uh, Mata. He's just going to continue to run forward here. No one wants to close him down. It's a great run by Juan Mata. He's won himself a corner. The Spaniard to fits this one in. Oh, that's beautiful. That is beautifully worked, straight from the training ground. What a delivery by Mata, and what a volley and finish by Schneiderlin. And here is Martial, he's lost possession, good bit of defending. Chance to come forward, Schneiderlin goes diving in, the referee says, you know what, let's play on. And it's a good advantage. Fletcher, cutting inside. Well, he goes down. Has he given the penalty? Well, I'm not sure what he's given there. Was that a dive? Well, he went down there. 
And it, uh, it appears to be a dive. Fletcher has been booked for diving. Well, the referee saw no contact. Fair enough to the referee there. It's a good decision by him. Well, wait a minute. Come out. He's made a meal of it. Can you believe this? Man United, what are you playing at? And Harnik picks up his second goal. So Luigi's had enough. He's bringing on Griezmann. He's bringing on Rooney. And replacing Martial. Up top. Or on the wing, should I say. And James Wilson. But Man United, I mean, giving away goals for fun. And now, once again, we're all level. Two apiece. And United looking to get back in this as quick as a flash. The ball's deflected. It's cleared away. Only as far as Schneidlin hit. He lines up a strike. And Foster with a great hand to tip it round the post. And it was a dangerous delivery last time. Matter looking for the same one. This time, it isn't a great delivery. Couldn't beat the front man. Rojo wins the header. Here is uh, Ander Herrera. Well, West Bromwich Albion have got to be feeling pretty good about themselves. Although this is nicely worked by United. And Luke Shaw fizzes one in. Rooney with a speculative bicycle kick. His first touch of the game. And what a way to make an introduction. It was Fletcher who's on that early yellow card. Or not early yellow card, but a yellow card for his uh, antics earlier. And here is Anthony Griezmann. Well, he's still going. Tipped away by Foster. Oh, that's terrible play by Mata. He's got to be careful there. It wasn't a great challenge. He will go in the book. Here is Olsen. He's lost possession again, West Bromwich Albion. Rooney's come on. He's given United a bit of life. Mata. Lovely pass. Rooney's header tipped away again by Foster. Seems to be Mr. Butterfingers at the moment. Well, that's a good challenge, but United will win it back here without a Herrera. Delivers this one in towards the back post this time. It's a good challenge by Damian. Finding matter. The referee says play on. He's trying to find Rooney. Nine minutes on the clock. What a game we've had. So many chances. West Bromwich Albion still in this game. Looking for that winning goal. And the way United are defending at times, it's a possibility that it could come. Here's McLean. It's a bit of a risky place, though, for West Bromwich Albion to try and play it out the back. It's done really well, though. It's a good challenge by Rojo. Poking it through. Rooney. Wanting Griezmann to make a run. It's a good turn by Rooney, but fantastic defending because they read it well. Rooney bundles his way back into it. Loses possession. Morrison picks it up. Fletcher. Harnick, this is a chance for West Bromwich Albion. United have been caught. Here's Gardner. How's the delivery? It's in perfect. Oh, it's come off the post. And <laughs> West Bromwich Albion. They've only done it. Unbelievable. Morrison is on the score sheet. United, United, United. Well, if you're a United fan, you're probably going to commit suicide after this game. What a delivery this is, though. Perfectly weighted. You thought this was in. It comes off the post. And there's the luck that West Brom have today. Well, this will be a disaster for United if they cannot get something. And at the moment, it just not looked like it's going to happen. There isn't much time to be played. West Brom and Jabin continue to push forward. Here's McLean. Comes off Jones. Fizz back in. Cleared away this time. Griezmann can't win the header. Rooney flicks it on. Fletcher. Anywhere will do. And that could be the last kick of the game. Long ball by Valdez. Griezmann's header's not great. Here is the Frenchman. He's lost possession. West Brom just get it out. There it is. What a result. For West Bromwich Albion, Man United have got to think long and hard at the moment of what's happening. They have not won a game in four matches. It has finished West Brom 3, United 2. But look at that, five shots to 15. And United couldn't come home with the three points. Harnik, no surprise, was your man of the match. 
So other results, have a look here. Tottenham drew with Liverpool, Man City won. That's not good news. Arsenal also won, bad news there, but Chelsea did lose. So now, I mean, we're seven points behind Arsenal, four points behind City, we remain third, but oh dear, oh dear. What has happened there? West Bromwich Albion, I mean, the bottom of the table, <laughs> they won their first game. Oh, I didn't even know that. That makes it even worse. I can't believe it. I'm absolutely gutted with that. Valdez is useless in goal. I'm not playing him anymore. I'm going to play Sam Johnston instead. Anyway, next up we've got Tottenham. And that's going to be another tough game. De Gea is such a net and clinical player. Or, sorry, neat and clinical player. Okay, is the maestro there. Players with the same registered position will earn more experience points in training. Well, good, because we need some. The scouts also come back. So we'll take a look at that in the next episode. But we're playing Tottenham. We're back at Old Trafford. We have to win this match because at the moment oh dear oh dear anyway hope you guys are enjoying it it's what happens sometimes you guys want to see me lose games well it does happen we'll be back with some more shortly but until next time take it